It's February and that means in the US and Canada it's Black History Month. Black History Month grew from Negro History Week, which was promoted by historian Carter Woodson and prominent African-American minister Jesse Moorland who hoped to raise awareness of African-American's contribution to civilization. Founding the Association for the Study of Negro Life and History, in 1925 the Negro History Week was announced and first implemented in the second week of February. The event encompassed the birthdays of both Abraham Lincoln and Frederick Douglass and received an overwhelming response by the public. With the growing awareness of black identity and the civil rights movement, Negro History Week evolved into Black History Month, officially designated by President Gerald Ford in 1976. The President of the United States urged the public to seize the opportunity to honor the two often neglected accomplishments of black Americans in every area of endeavor throughout our history. So every year during February schools across the U.S. created opportunities for students to learn about people's accomplishments such as Martin Luther King Jr., Rosa Parks, Malcolm X and many more who have contributed to the fight for equality of human lives. The UK also celebrates Black History Month since 1987, however it is held in October rather than February. This month is not free of controversy including debates about the fairness of dedicating a month to the history of one race. However there is something we should not forget. Acknowledging those who fought for equality of human lives, no matter what heritage, beliefs or race standing together, being educated about the past and encouraging a future for everyone is what Black History Month emphasizes.